so at the last minute i decided to quickly pay a visit to the um, um at the Amy Bero auditorium at uh, Alaska Secretariat to see what the livestock and aquaculture trade fair 2022 was you no know, what, what it was featuring since uh, it was about to end and I hadn't had time to go there at all I just felt since other people were saying they weren't keen on it let me just see what was happening there and so here's what I found out I understand today is the last day uh, so I'm just trying to see if I can talk to people that who is doing the coconut gari? Okay. What was that? Good afternoon. I was watching a video by one guy from Ghana okay. and they were talking about uh, you know, sweet potato. Yes. Sweet potato gari or something like that. No, you can have the um, soft gari like moringa. Okay. You can, you can do gari with soya beans, gari with orange. Okay. You know when you are frying it, you would have prepared your fruits and then you add to it. So, yeah. so it's possible to. So that's different. why they are calling it uh, sweet potato gari. It wasn't that like they use the sweet potato itself to make gari or something. No, 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 no. They <laughs> okay. added sweet potato to the, to gari, the gari to fortify it. Okay. Just like the one that is done with moringa. So okay. that people that are supposed to have less sugar okay, they they don't have to. can have that to make their eba. The vegetable in the moringa will help pushing that gari. So if they make eba, it's not just plain eba. eba okay. So they can so have it with nutrients. more vegetable soup and they can okay. eat. But you can't say somebody should not eat at all. After, After a while, in a year, <laughs> you feel hungry to eat the vegetable. But the vegetable, even just once just in a year. Little bit so when they have that kind of special gari with moringa or yeah. gari with orange or gari with pineapple, you get that relief that okay, but you are teacher eba. At least once. Exactly once. <laughs> okay, what is coconut gari? Okay, it's the coconut, it's the gari that has coconut that you also have to process coconut and add to the gari before you fry. Right. So when you want to drink is specifically for drinking okay. not for making ever this time around ever. so you don't need to start eating you know those ones that they'll buy coconut and be eating corn or they'll buy coconut okay, and I mean, be drinking garlic. so it's already inside it it's already inside all you need to do is just add water and drink and it is nice yeah very nice okay I so can that's give a sample. okay <laughs> to sample so you can tell me how it is <laughs> I didn't even know. Anyway, let me try it. Okay. You can have gari with all sorts of things. Mm, yeah, the flavor is there. Yeah. Mm. Very nice. Okay. So this is the um, offada rice. Yes, it is offada rice. There's I hear it's spices. expensive. Yeah, it is. Why? Because it's not polished. It's local rice. I mean, our cost of production in Nigeria, generally in Africa, is very high. Okay. We don't have power. We are the one that the roads are not good. So even if you said that the food produce is cheap but, but to get to it. the farm there are no roads so the vehicle spends a lot more time it gets damaged easily and people so they have from to them anyway. exactly and all of those things have <laughs> an impact cost. on the you see orange is supposed to be like 20 naira 30 naira but by the time it gets to town it's like 100 naira yeah. because all those costs we have they to have add to factor it. it into it Okay. Unfortunately, we yeah. have the harvest, but well, you cannot expensive. get it to the right consumers. Exactly. So this is also okay. Gary, this is just plain gari. Then that coconut gari is the one coconut gari. Okay. okay. Uh, that one is Olumi Day. Uh, Olai Day. Olai Day. Sorry. Yes, please. Sorry. This is. Oh, you want to pay our cash? Are you? And this is honey. Oh, okay. And it's four two for the fortified and three eight for the plain. Interesting. It's four thousand two for the fortified and three eight for the plain. That's I think you can see the phone number. Yes, four two. So I have done my best to give you guys. I think this is still the same thing. You. you can see the information there. So, okay. This is what I'm talking about, value addition, because you've processed now. Yes. So you're taking your product to the next level. Yes. I think that's important. You guys have a website? Yeah. Okay. So what is the website? RoyalSiblings.com uh, RoyalSiblings.com Yeah, that's RoyalSiblings.com okay. I'm sure you can, you'll notice readily that in all the visuals I have, there weren't any displays where we had animals like uh, whatever livestock of any kind or or fish you know because of livestock and aquaculture is what we're supposed to be talking about at the event i wasn't there i wasn't able to speak with uh, many people i didn't have much time i think i had just about 30 minutes but my point is that the display everything i had there you could see people selling devices um, computer-based devices things like that accessories um 
okay there were some people with packaged food products maybe about two stands there's people who are selling clothing um, all kinds of clothing for women and all that then at the rare so there wasn't really anything um along the lines of what one would have expected at the kind of event it was supposed to be so i guess the participation wasn't much so the lady i interviewed was the one person she was very forthcoming and i saw that she was into value addition processing that was what her company the company she represented was doing um so i didn't um want to go deeper than what i did because i felt it was better to just let her give us an insight into uh, the unique products that they had so the coconut gary for instance was very unique and then you could see the coolie coolie and all that but i didn't want to spend more time on all those other ones the, um, so that conversation was designed to just at least give those of you who i know will be my main audience something a bit different from what you might know but the question to ask is the organizers of this event what was it that they were doing that made it impossible for them to connect with and um, get a good response from livestock and aquaculture business owners in lagos I imagine it would be Lagos mainly that they would expect to get people coming in from, even though people come from, who come from everywhere else. But they didn't even get an engagement, and there's quite a number of people who are running those kind of businesses. Was it that they were... I, I'm going to try and investigate and find out what the issue was. And uh, it's interesting because the title of the event uh, completely goes against the content of the uh, of the venue. You know, So you begin to ask yourself, believe me, somebody actually told me this would happen and told me he was not going to attend it based on his understanding of the system in Lagos State, you know, the, the, the civil servants and all that. So I was a bit uh, surprised when it turned out he was actually very right. But it's a reflection of how disconnected the people who are running the, the government machinery seem to be from the industry. And this industry needs support. So all those uh, sponsors they put in the ad, which I'm going to play at the end of this, because just I want you to just compare what the ad was promising including the visit by the vice president the host being the governor himself all those things i'm sure you're even seeing it on the screen right now then compare that with what we had at the event i do not know what happened on day one and day two but on day three which would have been closing uh what would you have thought the closing day would be the one where you have the kind of uh, climax you know i didn't see anything resembling that but again like i said i only spent 13 minutes but what i saw there was it left very much very little to to imagine to the imagination all right so that's it uh, if you have any questions reach out to me using the contact details on your screen